want to share this word with you this morning. Praise the Lord. The Lord told me uh, as I was waking up before, he said, tell my people to become a lover of the word. Now we know we read the word every day. We, we hear the word preached. We uh, meditate on it. But God specifically said, the Lord really ministered to me, become a lover of the word. Become a student of the word. My daughter said the Lord uh, ministered to her on that line. And uh, I thought about that this morning as I wrote down what the Lord gave me. And uh, it just resonates with me this morning as he began to say it over and over again. Become a lover of the word. The Lord said, tell my people to become a lover of the word. Keep my word before your eyes. Keep the word in the midst of your heart. Um, talk of my word when you rise up as you go about your day. Meditate day and night in my word. And one of the scriptures that comes to me is um, Joshua 1 and 8, where God told Joshua to meditate on the word day and night that he would prosper, he would make his way prosper, he would be with him because Joshua had just taken the lead to lead the people on into the promised land. He had served faithfully with Moses. He was his he was his minister. Thank you, baby. He was his minister. And he had been faithful, didn't know that God was going to elevate him like that. And but he did and but God also encouraged him. So the Lord is telling us today allow my word to dwell in you teach my word preach my word and live my word says the Lord as you do this you will get to know me you will understand my ways you will hear my thoughts feel my heartbeat and as you are led by my spirit then my will shall be done in the earth. As you study my word, I will set my seal of approval on you, and, 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 and you will be a workman with no shame, because I will teach you my principles, my ways of doing things, my way of handling things, and I will give you power and authority over all power of the enemy and you will be able to endure all that may come your way hallelujah I the Lord will fully equip you to walk effectively so that souls will be won and lives changed by my power and my spirit and my anointing says the Lord I encourage you today, become a lover of the word. 2 Timothy 2, 15, a scripture we quote a lot, hallelujah, it says, um, study to show thyself approved unto God, a workman that needed not to be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth and that word study simply means to give earnest uh, and diligent and eager attention to to pay attention to be eager to be diligent to hide the word in your heart be eager to take the word in every day it's not uh, you know the word of God um, really lets us know who God is what he likes what he doesn't like what he tolerates, which he doesn't tolerate sin, all right? What he doesn't tolerate, or right? what he allows, what he doesn't, you know what I'm saying? Um, when, you, when you really decide that you want to get to know him, really, your life will change. You know, like I said this morning, I woke up and, and I, 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 did not, I did not really sleep. It's just like that sometimes when the Lord is calling you to a higher place in Him. 
He wants you to spend time with him. And, and his time is, you know, his different times of day, times, times of night, in the morning. You know, I know we, we, we work and we do all these things. Cool. But beloved, God is still calling you to a higher place of prayer. He's calling you to a, a, a pocket with him because of the things that he wants to do in the earth realm. God is moving. Revival is taking place. I just just saw a testimony where a young man, had, had, I believe he overdosed and he died. And he was dead for like 19 hours. You know, unheard of to be dead that long. Hallelujah. God bless you. And, and God, he, he came back to life. All right, they kept him on a ventilator to, to, uh, to, to, to harvest his organs. That was the plan. But God raised this man of God up. He's alive today. I saw the testimony. God is working miracles. I, I heard from a, my, my brother in Michigan and, and how God is, is, uh, is, is pouring out revival in his church. It, 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 you know, my, my brother, my brother, Pastor Mike Sparks, he's my brother. We, ra we were raised in the same church, you know, came from the same spiritual mama. And, and Abba Shad Abohaya, he just called me out of the blue and began to just say, it just warmed my heart and began to tell me about revival that's breaking out there. How they had such an awesome service and how revival, just the spirit of revival. Beloved, God is moving and he's wanting us to get linked with him now. He says, become a lover of the word. Become a lover of God. When you love him, hallelujah, you will sacrifice. Glory to God. You won't mind getting up. You won't mind getting in the presence of God. You won't mind it. Come on here. He'll strengthen you. He will keep you. He'll give you what you need. Come on, somebody. We got to get out of ourselves. So many of us are full of self. We don't want to sacrifice. You want God to use you. You want to be, oh, you want to flow in the gifts? Come on here. But you don't want to sacrifice. You got to sacrifice. You got to lay that flesh down. You got to be willing to get up. You got to be willing to lay out before the Lord. You got to be willing to cry out for the souls. God wants souls to be saved. And you cannot see it. Walking in religion, walking in tradition, and walking the way you've been used to walking. Praying for two minutes is not going to make it. Praying bless me prayers. It's not going to make it. It's not about me. It's about him. It's about God. It's about the souls. And somebody has to stand in the gap and make up the hedge. As we give you, amen, keys about the enemy and how he will come. It's just to combat him. It's to know how to combat him. But the, the, the real thing is getting in a place with God. Yes, he'll give you those offensive weapons, but he also will tell you to come aside with me and get in my presence. And this is why God used Joshua, because he stayed as close to God as he could. He stayed as close to the presence of the Lord as he could. He didn't know what God was going to do for him, but he knew it was something about just getting the residue. I can't go all the way up with Moses, but I can go as far as I can go and we have to have that determination god i thank you today oh my you gotta be willing to sacrifice because there are souls dying they're dying every day they're falling over in the hell oh my there's a cry going out in the land there's a cry going out in the land and God is wanting to know does anybody hear it do you hear it do you hear it do you hear oh my shay the blood of Abel cried out from the ground when he was murdered and God heard it oh my 
Shay and he called Cain into accountability and he's calling us into accountability. Do you hear the cry? Oh my shadabo say karabo shadabo say mandariabo shatarabo sata. God is saying arise ababa shaya. Get out of your comfort zone. Na, 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 and come aside with me, said the Lord. For I, the Lord thy God, I desire to move in the midst of my people. But I'm looking for a people that will cry loud, that will seek my face, that will travail. Oh, my shame, my double shot until breakthrough happens in the spirit. It's in the spirit where battles are won. But if we don't go up in the spirit of God, if we don't go up in war, how can we see victory? Oh, my shot, I will say, it's not automatic, beloved. We've got to do the work now. God is aligning the warriors. He's aligning intercessors. He's aligning us together to come aside with him and seek his face and call on heaven. Glory to God. Yes, there's a real enemy, but God is real. God is real on today, and he's trying to equip us. I say trying because some of us are not doing what he's saying, but God is encouraging us today. Become a lover of the word. Become a lover. Fall in love with Jesus. Fall in love with him. Set aside some of these desires and things that you think that you've just got to have and set that aside and come aside with God. Let God be God. Seek him first and the things that need to be added to you, God will add them. He will add them. Oh, my shame. Mandabo shatabo say. Mandabe sheke nabo say. Mandabo shekadabo saya. Oh, nasha. My God today. God is wanting to shake you from the very foundation of your soul. Everything that's not like God, God wants to get rid of it. But you've got to get in his presence and stay there. Wrestle with God. Oh my God, like Jacob did. Jacob finally got to a point. He went for 20 some years playing around with God. But one night, one night, one night, he got serious. He said, wait a minute. Just a little dab is not going to do me. I'm going up and I'm not coming down until I get the blessing. And he wrestled all night. All night. And we think if we lose three hours sleep, we've lost something. Oh my God, I'm shy. You haven't lost anything. Glory be to God. God made your body. He knows how to replenish it. And he knows how to refresh us. And he knows how to pull us aside. Come on here, somebody. But Jacob wrestled all night. Hallelujah. He became, he went from being a trickster to a prince with God. Oh my shot, I'm shy. Oh my God, God changed him. Hallelujah, revolutionized him. And that's what God has to do with us. He has to take everything out of us that's not like him. We still look like ourselves. We're walking around like ourselves. And people can't see Jesus because they see you. Hard of shot, I will say they see the stubbornness in you. Hope my shot, I will say they see the rebellion in you. They see the attitude. Hope my shot, I will say the bad attitude in you. Come on here, somebody. But you got to mortify the deeds of the flesh. Oh, my shame. You got to put on the bowels of mercy. Glory to God. He's saying, come out. Today, become a lover of the word. My God, I thank him today. Become a lover of the word. Become a lover of the word. Become a lover of him. Fall in love with Jesus. Get him in your belly. Horrible. Say, let the Holy Ghost take over. Glory to God. He will do in you what only he can do. Oh, I thank him today. That thing just... Amen. Just resonated in me this morning and it's still glory to God. I, I thank God for the word. I thank him for quickening and I thank him for shaking me from the foundation of my own soul. Come on here because the word come to us first leaders. 
before you can really, amen, give it over. You got to let it go in. Oh, my shy. Oh, my shakata bosaya. Oh, my shakata haya. Glory to God. You got to get out of yourself. Stop being ashamed. Stop being bashful. Glory to God and let God fill you with his boldness so you'll go forth and proclaim the word of the Lord. Give it and speak it and declare it with faith, with authority. Come on, somebody, with boldness and courage. Glory to God. Don't be ashamed of the gospel of Christ because it is the power of God unto salvation. Come on here, somebody. You got to know that God is with you and that he loves you. And when he begins to burden your heart, it's for a reason. It's not for us. It's for the souls out there. It's for those that are crying that can't get to God. It's for that one that's that's so loaded down with mental, mental issues and mental, emotional issues. But God gives us how to get to them and pull them out. Come on here, somebody. Amen. Somebody got to be a sacrifice. Jesus was the ultimate sacrifice. Hallelujah for our sins. Glory to God so that we might be, amen, free and we might be healed. Come on, somebody. So he frees us, delivers us, and sets us free and heals us so we can go get somebody else. Come on here. Glory to God. So become a lover of the word on today. Become a lover of the word. God will do in you what only he can do. When you surrender your all to him. Hallelujah. 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 There's some people, amen, you get on. Amen. I know this. Praise the Lord. By the Spirit of the Lord, you're still trying to do it your way. Give your way over to God. Beloved had to do that. Give your way over to God. Just trust him. He know what to do and he knows how to do it. I thank God for what he's doing. I thank God for every one of you because I know God is doing a giving you a deposit that you need. That's what morning matter is all about. Getting the bread from heaven. Hallelujah. To be able to hear the word of the Lord over in the morning. Come on, somebody. It's a blessing. Come on here to stay linked in with God. Hallelujah. Keep flesh crucified. Come on here. Staying free from sin. Come on, somebody. That's right. Being totally submitted and totally surrendered to the will of God. It's not about what I want, what you may want. It should be about what the will of the Father is. And when you become a lover of the word, you will hear his heartbeat. You'll know what he wants to say and he'll give you how to do it come on somebody he's building an army amen glory to god an army of people that will go forth in power and demonstration of the anointed of god where god will manifest himself in a real way where souls will be saved and won to the kingdom of god and folk will be healed miracles will be wrought by the hands of men and women of god that god has laid his anointed on so i encourage you today become a lover of the word father i thank you today for your anointing i thank you right now for your presence i thank you father for your people i ask you dear lord to uh, uh encourage them today and build them up today and resident this word today and take us further father take us where only you can take us to god hide us behind the cross god in the mighty name of jesus do the work god build up your people build up your men servants your maid servants your apostles, your prophets uh, on today, God, the visionaries, the vanguards, hallelujah, the pioneers, uh, oh my God, the prophets, the seers, uh, the prophetic intercessors, build them up on today, build up the evangelists on today, build up the pastors and the shepherds, uh, oh my God, and the teachers on today, my God, in the mighty name of Jesus, we thank you and we praise you for your word, God, God, don't let the word slip 
good from us, God. Don't let the curse of this life, oh God, cause the word to slip in the mighty name of Jesus. God, we thank you. God, we praise you. God, we love you today. We appreciate you right now. Strengthen your people, God. Strengthen them, oh God. Give them the push, God, to go on. Give them a push, God, to obey you. Give them a push, God, to surrender, God. Give them a push today. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus, we thank you now. We praise you now. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen. Beloved, the Lord loves you. <laughs> he cares about you. <laughs> Woo, I love it. He has your best interests at heart. And he definitely will work all things out for you just because he loves you and just because he cares. I thank God for the miracles and healings he's brought in. He's performing. Glory to God. He's blessing on today. God bless you, Minister Cosby, woman of God. Hallelujah. This is a powerful woman of God. I look to see her on Periscope soon. Honda Boche. She got a word down in her belly. Hallelujah. A prayer down in her spirit. Oh, my she Bashata. God, I love you today. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Glory be to God. Thank you, Jesus. We thank him today. I want you to stay encouraged, beloved. Hallelujah. Stay encouraged. Keep the prayer wheels turning, as they say. Stay in the fire. Don't come out the fire. Stay connected with God. Stay connected with him. Hallelujah. Keep your eyes on him. Let God be God in your life. Glory to God. Bless you. Amen. Prophetess Maddie. Thank the Lord. Hallelujah. We appreciate every one of you. I thank God for all of you. Praise the Lord. If you have prayer requests, we want you to share them with us. You can type them in, praise God, or you can send them to morningmanna2016 at gmail.com. Send us your prayer requests. Send us your praise reports. Come on here, somebody. God is moving. And I thank God for everything that he is is doing on today. We want you to be encouraged, be edified and lifted up. Amen. God is just, amen. He's so good. So, uh, other things on my heart, but I, I am not released to share. Praise the Lord. But just know this, beloved, God is on your side. Okay. Can y'all pray for me? I have court in three hours. Okay. Lord God, we ask that you touch uh, this dear heart. I believe were you on the other day and we were praying for you. Praise the Lord. Is this the young man that was on? And, and, and Father, touch him right now. This court situation, you know about it. Hallelujah. I ask that you minister to him right now, Father. Let you, Okay, I thought so. God bless you. Amen. We're praying for you. Amen. Lord, touch him now. You know what this is about, Father God. You undertake for him in the name of Jesus. Thank you that you're drawing him by your spirit. Thank you, Father, for what you're doing. Hallelujah. <clears throat> if you don't mind... Son, can you share your word? Share your name. Just share share your name if you don't mind. Praise God so we can lift you up. Praise the Lord because you've been on my heart. Hallelujah. Thank God for you today. Father God, thank, thank you for Chris. I want everybody to pray for Chris. Pray for him. Praise the Lord. Father, touch him. Father God, move in his life. We thank you that that hook you done got in his jaw, Father God. And Lord God, I just ask that you minister to him by the power of the Holy Ghost. Touch this court situation. Father God, we give it over into your hands now. And we thank you, God. Hallelujah. Let him come out on top. Whatever the situation is, Father, you settle it, Lord God. In Jesus' name, we thank you. Minister to him. Minister to his family. Hallelujah. Father God, work things out for him. God. And Father, we thank you that you're breaking down every wall, every addiction, every habit, everything that's not like you in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes. Show yourself to him, God. Jesus, you stand up. You stand up and show him who you are, Lord. Hallelujah. And Father, we thank you. We praise you. We give you glory. We give you honor. Hallelujah. And we magnify your name for it in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you now. Hallelujah. For your presence, we thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. We appreciate you all. Continue to pray for him today. Pray for Chris. Lift him up. Hallelujah. I have my prayer book. Praise God. It's not right in here. It's right here. Amen. And I write down the names. Praise God. In my prayer book. Praise the Lord. This is my prayer. My prayer journal. 
Hallelujah. And I write, so many people send me requests, and I do. I take it to heart just to let you know. I write them down. I carry this with me. Praise the Lord. So we will write your name in here. Praise God. Amen. <clears throat> it's easy to type and all that, and I love to type. But the Lord told me, write this thing down. Write these requests down. Read them off to me when you sit in front of me. This is how the Lord is dealing with me. So much God has given me, beloved. I can't give it all to you. Praise God. I think God wants to give you things, too, and he is doing it. Praise God. Rodney from Cushing. All right. Rodney from Cushing. Okay. We pray for Rodney right now. In Jesus' name, we ask you to touch Rodney. Hallelujah. Father God, minister to him right now. In the mighty name of Jesus, we thank you for him now. We praise you, Father God, for what you're doing. Touch and minister, Father God, by the power of the Holy Ghost. We thank you for him today. Oh God, meet every need, seen and unseen, God. In Jesus' name, we rebuke the devourer for his sake right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We thank you. We praise you. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes. Thank you, Evangelist Christina. Follow us on Facebook. Amen. Apostle Deborah Vales, probably for you. Thank you for that. Thank you, Lord God. Anybody else, leave your, leave your name. We will definitely, I'll write it down. Hallelujah. Praise God. We'll be praying. Praise the Lord. We have warriors. Amen. God calls us on alert. We, we were on alert the other night. Praise God. You are welcome. God bless you. Praise the Lord. Jesse, all right, we lift up Jesse right now. In the name of Jesus, we lift up Jesse. Hallelujah. Lord, touch Jesse in Jesus' name. Minister right now in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you and we praise you for it in Jesus' name. Minister right now, Lord God, strength, Father, comfort God. Whatever the need is, Father, you feel it, you meet it. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Yes, we also have a website, www dot morning dash manna dot org hallelujah amen we're going to be putting media up my daughter pastor janitha there she is right there amen pastor janitha is we're working on our website she's she, she works with me amen so we're working diligently to get the website up praise god amen we we, we do have a our own publishing and own design ministry if you will insp dash creation productions.com amen design with you in mind praise the lord amen so she's our web uh, our, our, our graphic designer praise god god is just giving us a lot of streams and we're we're, we're running in these streams now y'all praise the lord so we thank god for everything god gave me another another show this morning and i told y'all god give me some stuff praise the lord i have to write it down praise god but he's giving me another show to do praise the lord and, and gave me gave it to me this morning praise the lord amen I, I i will give you a sneak peek but i can't do that yet i'm gonna write it down first okay praise god but i believe it's gonna be a blessing and we're gonna already go go ahead and start doing some taping for it praise the lord i thank god for what he's doing because of the vision god's given me and he told me years ago that i would be on the internet television internet radio praise god that's why i came off yesterday with set free live and that we've done some recording we've done some taping amen set free live is the radio side hallelujah praise god this is this is a portion of the television side and there's another program that will be coming amen soon praise the lord hallelujah so i thank god because i know when you walk in the vein of the holy ghost when you amen submit your way to god amen he'll make your way perfect praise god and so we thank god for set free outreach ministries we thank god for all of you we're getting ready to let you go praise god morning manna in the morning praise god be blessed and be encouraged and stay in the vein of the lord and remember become a lover of the word remember the ones that we're praying for praise god chris amen and and uh, was it rodney praise god it was three people amen and i and my mind just went blank praise god but i'm going back amen rodney thank you praise the lord and chris praise the lord so we want to make sure that we and jesse thank you i knew it was three jesse rodney and chris we want to pray for them y'all keep them in prayer be blessed today love you god bless